A heavily armored arachnid used as plasma artillery, the Scorpion-class Pulse Warrior, or simply Scorpion, was deployed during the Second Bug War. The Scorpion's heavy armor hinders its movement and agility, but its defensive capabilities make up for it against mobile infantry troopers. Its hardened shell can withstand virtually all rifle rounds, only being shown to be punctured by a grenade round. The Scorpion was seen in battle against mobile infantry troopers at their outpost on Roku-san, where the mobile infantry was caught off guard and lost the fight. This was brought upon by the God Bug's influence over Sky Marshal Anok, who disabled the electric perimeter fence allowing the arachnids to overrun the compound, which led to Rico being blamed for the battle lost and his troopers being put in danger without warning. In terms of appearance and specifications, the Scorpion features large pincers and a plasma thrower tail. It is 42 feet or 13 meters in length and stands roughly 20 feet or 6 meters tall. It can move at a speed of 10 miles per hour and can fire plasma bursts at over 100 miles per hour, which can punch through almost anything and devastate infantry units. Its main weakness is its agility as it can be easily taken down with proper coordination among the mobile infantry. The Scorpion is bundled in the same category as the Plasma Bug as they are deployed for heavy artillery against a massive compound, or collection of troopers. What do you guys think of the Scorpion Bug? A fun bit of trivia for Starship Troopers 3 is that the Scorpion was the only bug fully hand-controlled by puppeteers during filming, with the Plasma Blast being added in post-production. As always, thanks for watching, my name is Nick, and if you desire to learn more about Starship Troopers, subscribe to Hybrid Network. Work.